Kirill's injuries were worse than we thought, and he needed much time to recover. It has been three years now since Walter's death. A great war raged between the island nations and the Kuluk Empire, all because of the accursed rune of punishment. Then, thanks to a heroic young leader, the island nations banded together to take the Kuluk Empire head on. They destroyed Fort El Il, the Kuluk Empire's southernmost base, and a temporary truce was reached. What you riding, huh? What? Come on, no need to hide it, is there? Oh, I bet there's something juicy in there, huh? Juicy? Don't be ridiculous. It's just a journal. Oh, really? I'm serious. No peeking. Mm-hmm. Yan sure is a strange one. Hmm? I mean, she's been watching over Kira like that for how many years now? I wonder if that was Walter's dying wish. I suppose in her own way, Yan understands who the leader of this group is. Hmm, good point. Well, thanks to her, Carol's looking a lot better lately. I think it's about time we set out again. Actually, I've been thinking the same thing. We should probably find some work soon. It might take our minds off what happened. Yeah, good idea. Walter may be gone, but I'll make sure Kirill doesn't suffer the same fate. I made a promise. Well, don't take all the credit. I'm coming along too, you know. After all, I need to keep my eye on you. What do you mean by that? <laughs> Just kidding, silly. Oh, okay. Sometimes you can just be so clueless. Hey, and don't go writing anything weird in that journal of yours. Of course I won't. 